last year. How are we doing, Winston? Uh, was it difficult this week knowing that Tennessee's coming up to focus on Van Dino? Uh, no. I mean, we just didn't want to, you know, look past, you know, Vandy. We just, everybody was just focused on uh, what we had, you know, for us this week against Vandy. So we was all focused on what we needed to do. And, you know, everybody just uh, did their job. And, you know, I think that it was a, a big transition, you know, coming out in the second half. Our defense and offense played extremely well. And, you know, and I give all my praises and everything to the seniors, you know, this their last time playing on this field, man. And <clears throat> Ricky, you know, Ricky Lunkin gave us a gr great speech, you know, during halftime. You know, it, it, it sparked everybody up. And we just all went out there and not only playing for ourselves, but playing for the seniors as well. So, this, was this your best game? I mean, 18 tackles, a couple tackles behind the line, man. Uh, I wouldn't say that, man. I guess I'll try to play, you know, every game is my best game. I mean, I just let the game come to me, you know. I don't really worry about, you know, tackles that much. I'm just, you know, doing my job and, you know, just trying to make plays and, you know, trying to be the best player, you know, on the field. Tay got thrown out, man. Were they, I mean, it seemed like there was back and forth going on the whole game. Were they Were they dirty? I mean, were they kind of dirty out there? Um, I don't, to be honest with you, I, I can't really tell you. I, I ain't really see anything, but, I mean, that was, that was you know, transitional words, you know, back and forth between some of the players, but I didn't really, you know, get to see what uh, what happened between Tay, you know, and the other guy, but, I mean, from what I was hearing, you know, I heard they were, you know, doing some, you know, dirty stuff out there, but, you know, they weren't doing it to me, but, I mean, I guess, you know, they were trying to let the refs know what they was doing and stuff, and they, were, they was, you know, calling the calls, but, I mean, I think that, you know, whatever happened, you know, I guess the decision that the ref made, you know, was best for you know, both teams. So, I mean, it was a decision we had to go with. Would you call this the biggest uh, win of the season so far for you guys? Um, no, man, I, I would say South Carolina was probably the biggest one. But I think this was, this was a huge game for the seniors, though. Because this is their last time, you know, playing on, on this field, man. I think it was big for them, and it was, it was a very emotional game for them. And, you know, and I'm glad that I got a chance to, you know, play with these guys, you know, that late last time on this field. And, you know, and I get my utmost respect to everybody. You know, everybody came and, you know, played their butts off. Yeah. What's your thoughts on uh, the matchup in two weeks in front of 100,000 people down in Knoxville? I mean, I'm ready for it. I, you know, I'm, I'm sure that, you know, my teammates are ready for it as well. We just, you know, just got this bye week. You know, everybody can get their, uh, you know, body and stuff rested up. You know, just get, you know, mentally prepared, you know, for everything. And, you know, just take our time and, you know, and just, just do what we've we been doing, man. I think that last week we had a good three days of practice, you know, to prepare for Vandy. And I think that we're going to do the same thing as well. So everybody, you know, just going to get their minds right. You know, everybody's going to try to get healthy, you know, for these next two weeks. And, you know, we're just going to go down there and, you know, try to break the street. Have a good Thanksgiving. Thank you. Which one of the seniors cried first? Um, Ricky. Was it? Yeah, um, actually it was Friday night before we had our last snack. Um, you know, they, he had the, uh, the players come up there and talk, and, you know, and, you know, he, he was saying that, you know, he ain't never been an emotional guy, but I think that, you know, it really got to him. It was really emotional how, you know, the way he felt. And, you know, I understand, you know, all the stuff that, you know, he done been through and everything that he done went through through this program. You know, and I give my respect to, you know, Ricky Lumpkin and all the seniors you know, that's been here for five or four years. And, you know, I'm, I'm glad that I got a chance to, to play with all these guys my years here. And, you know, I, just things go by so fast, you know, just next year I'll be a senior. You know, I feel like I just got here just as well. So Did know, it make I'm, you think ahead a little to your yeah, senior? Yeah, it did. It made me think, you know, what, what's going to happen when, when I'm a senior. And, you know, I'm going to be in the same position as, as they were. So, you know, I'm just, you know, living each day, you know, and just, you know, just being proud of, you know, just playing with these guys, you know, for these last, you know, two games that we, we're going to have with these guys. Thanks, Wes.